Breaking news out of Orleans Criminal Court, where the jury now has a case in the Tyrone Steele murder trial. He's accused of killing five people over the course of 45 days in New Orleans. Chris Welty is live with the latest. Chris. Liz, yeah, the jury began deliberating about 12 minutes ago, around 1238. And as you can see on the steps of the courthouse, there's a lot of people. They have five families packed into this courtroom. There are very few seats that were still open. Now, 20 year old Tyrone Steele was arrested when he was 18 years old. He's accused of going on a murder spree, killing five people over 45 days in 2022. In one case, Steele allegedly shot three people to death at an apartment on Encampment Street. In closing arguments, the defense told the jury this case lacks evidence. Steele's attorney said, quote, we're talking about Mr. Steele's life, freedom and future. Not guilty is a just verdict. End quote. The defense went on to say when the jury hears from the state for the last time, they will witness, quote, an Oscar worthy performance from Mr. Williams on the state's desk. Several guns, bullets and casings allegedly from Steele were on display during closing arguments. District attorney Jason and Williams said, quote, this is not a prop as he held one of those guns. This is a real assault weapon that fires very real bullets. This is not a prop. This is a Glock with a laser pointer that was found with the defendant. None of these are props. These are not rubber pellets that might leave a bruise when fired in a movie. They obliterate skulls, brain matter and change lives. End quote. The jury was shown photos, social media posts, plus surveillance of Steele driving what the state said was a victim's car that smelled like a decomposing body, but it was drenched in blood. Now, if found guilty, Steele faces life in prison. Reporting live at Criminal Court, Chris Welty, Fox 8 Local First.